through the Chesapeake Bay. We're on the first tunnel. We're going to rise up and get on the first island. And from there, we're going to take a very long bridge, which Petia will show you in a minute. And then from there, we're going to go dip inside a tunnel underneath the Chesapeake Bay. Then from there, come out, and we're going to do that twice. So this is quite interesting. This is just like going to the Keys. There's a, there's a steep trap guy on the right, there's a police, and it says 55, so I'm going 55, uh, and it, we are on the water. We're on top of the water, we're going through the Chesapeake Bay, and uh, I see a boat racing with us on the left. Can you show that one? Oh, yeah. Yeah? We're not even in the middle yet. I know, I said, honey, make sure that your GoPro is ready. <coughs> and as we're getting on it, she says, oh, it's not working. <laughs> <laughs> but then because it is a shallow bay, when there's a storm coming from Atlantic, um, it creates haven short choppy waves it comes from everywhere so it's not very easy to sail in Chesapeake Bay in times of storm be ready for tunnel passage okay. they asked they asked us if we have a propane off and we said no so we're just kind of going through all right now we're going below the sea can you imagine that? Uh, Chesapeake Channel Tunnel. Yay! That's what it says. Chesapeake Channel, Channel Tunnel. Okay. It kind of rhymes nicely. The deep end. And then from here, we're going to climb up. But this is a, a very tight tunnel. Especially for trucks and trailers. Wow. There's a light at the end of the tunnel. There's a second tunnel in three miles. Good afternoon from Tales of Terror. Another day. Another adventure. Well, we didn't have much of adventure today. We were tired and it was hot. So we spent most of the morning in the camper working. And in the afternoon we took a nap, just like we usually we usually did when we had our boat. <laughs> <laughs> and now it's nice and cool and we're out and we're hoping to catch the sunset. We're just walking around our North Landing RV Resort. It is a resort. It's and a beautiful, I like very much. Yeah, it has everything. It has... Yes. Uh, Even they have a cinema. A cinema, yeah. Open air cinema. And they do, and they have uh, miniature golf, they have uh, tennis courts, and, and they have all kinds of activities. Uh, it would be nice to spend uh, some time here. Because of 4th of July weekend, it is almost 
packed, packed <laughs> the rim with RV. from Tales of Terra. Another day. Another adventure. Today is the 4th of July weekend day and we're leaving. Actually, the rush <laughs> had started yesterday and I'm sure it's going to continue today. And our campsite is full. Uh, actually, they did not have a, a room for us <laughs> for today or the weekend, so that's why we're leaving. But we're leave, leaving for some place that is very nice and we're very familiar with. Yay! We're going to John and Verda's! <laughs> it's about 170 miles and uh, easy drive, we hope. And uh, we will celebrate 4th of July with John. He already has uh, fireworks uh, scheduled for us. So here we come, John and Verda. We're like Bad Penny. You throw it away and it never goes away. It always come back. <laughs> bye bye. Mi amor no significa posesión no significa solución de tus problemas. Anda resuelve tu dilema. No te hagas ilusión. No quiero ser tu salvación. Tampoco soy tu rey. 